Anyways, alright, going live with part two in ten, nine, eight. And I'm back. Anyways, so, scoreline is 5-3 to three for Blood Wolf, who is not getting owned by the AI, surprisingly. Um, that's it. Let's get into the games here. I am impatient. I believe... Blood... Nope. Sorry. I believe Drawn Onward will be the next to play Spy here. Yep, yeah, here we go. Game number something. I'm not I'm not in the game screen. I'm in the game screen now. Alright. Quick flirt goes off. Not a green test, so two more of those will be necessary to um to finish that mission up. And things are surprisingly calm at the beginning of this game. Not a whole lot going on in the way of highlights, not a whole lot going on in the way of lowlights. Everything's just taking it easy. Drawn on one in a situation now here here now where he can flirt and banana bread. Goes for the flirt first. He should be able to finish that up with one more well placed flirt. I don't think he'll have to, I don't think he'll even have to green test it if he can get the placement right. Here goes the banana bread. Green tests that. Will he get highlight for it? Apparently the streams are a little bit off, so I can fix that fairly easily. Actually just lowlights everyone who wasn't red flannel jacket and wasn't in that conversation. I'm going to pause for a moment and then play again just to sync up the streams. As blood, sorry, drawn onward, gets his inspections done. So that's two missions and a half finished up. And though he is Hylet, he doesn't really seem to be. Oh my god, the bathing! Please tell me I'm not the only one who saw that. He got stuck. Anyways, gets the green test on the flirt to finish that up. One more mission to go and a minute and ten to do it. And four real suspects at this time. Six non lowlit, but four that it looks like Blood Wolf's really looking at. Goes for the bug, doesn't get it. I'm a little bit ahead here, so I'm going to once again pause and play it again. Sync up the streams. I, that was a bit too far. That should sync this up more properly. 30 seconds to go. Sorry, 35 seconds now to go. And one mission. He may have to resort to a swap here if he can't get to that ambassador in time. He's really just hanging out, taking his time, waiting for his opportunity. Patience is always a virtue in a game like Spy Party. Here he goes for his bug. Actually just setting himself up for it. 15 seconds. This is going to be tense. Let's look at what Blood Wolf sees. Here he goes. Goes for the wrong arm bug through the conversation. Does he get it? No, he doesn't. Oh my god. Two seconds to go. There's the bug. Goes off. Does he get it? He got the bug. And got red flannel jacket shot. Oh my goodness. I can't believe, actually, those bugs, even though they missed, were placed brilliantly. Those were actually very hard to see from... Blood Wolf's point of view, if he wasn't specifically watching for them, and I mean, I'm not entirely sure why he shot Red Flannel, I can only assume it's because he got the, um, the stuff mixed up, what happens where... What am I talking about? I believe the reason he shot Red Flannel Jacket was he was mixed up about what happens to overtime when you green watch check, is what I'm trying to say. <coughs> Don't inhale water, ladies and gentlemen. So... <coughs> 
Blood Wolf's coming, sorry, Drawn Wolf's coming back. Four to five is the scoreline going into the tenth game. Blood Wolf is spy here on Courtyard 2. And I really don't think this is the best time for Banana Bread. He goes for it anyway. Uh, really wanted the BB and run there. Actually coughed it. Got himself highlight for it as well, but not shot. So he still got a shot at this. If you'll pardon the accidental pun. Goes for the bug. I think he got that. Yeah, he did. He got that off unseen. Nicely done on that. That'll make his time somewhat easier. Goes for the actual banana bread here. There it goes. Drawn onward. Still just doing the usual business of low lighting everyone who it couldn't have been. And things are looking alright so far for Blood Wolf. Even with that cough, it looks like he might still be able to pull this out. As he grabs a drink to actually continue looking inconspicuous. Here he goes. I'm not sure where he's headed right now. Apparently just to a window. Everything is okay. Blood Wolf playing it cool. Letting Drawn Onward sizzle for a while. Pick up some other suspects. I've dropped 6,000 frames at this point. Which makes me sad. Blood Wolf coming in for a, flir a flirt here. Gets the green test on it, but wasn't quite... Close enough in for 50%. So two more of those, and we'll have that finished up. But he's starting to run out of time. A minute and ten seconds, and he doesn't have his inspects done. And those can take a moment. I can only assume he'll go do that right now. Either that or he'll go for another seduction. He's running out of time. He really does have to move here. Takes another drink, so he's going to have to go for the seducers before he goes for the inspects. But he doesn't really have a whole lot of time to get this done. Come on, Blood Wolf. You gotta move, man. You gotta move, man. Come on. Come on, man. Come on, man. You gotta do something. 35 seconds to go, and here he goes. Going to a seduction target. Can't quite make the seduce, seduce right here. Goes for the double flirt. Doesn't quite get it done. So... Drawn Onward ties it up at 5. We've got about 20 minutes to go. We've really got a game on our hands here. This is quite interesting. Tied up at 5 after 10 games. This is actually a hell of a match. It's so painful. To see that flirt, um, okay, now that my train of thought is stopped being derailed, let me try again. It always hurts me inside when I see a flirt at like 98%. And it wasn't the second one's fault, the second one did it, but the first one was where he didn't quite get close enough to pull off the flirt he needed. And it pains me to see that. Draw on, we're playing Spy here on the 11th game. Nothing really going on in, this, in the first 30 seconds of this match, as far as Drawn Onward is concerned. One quick highlight, but it's no one to be... It's no one to write home about, meaning it's not Drawn Onward. Draw Onward goes to the statues. He might actually know he's not going to go for the swap here. Blood Wolf's paying too close attention. I'm pretty sure he's going to get Hylet here either way. I'm not entirely sure what... Um, yeah, he, there he goes. There's the highlight. So he has his inspects done. Two minutes to go. This isn't going to be the greatest flirt, but he can get the banana bread off. There's the white test. So, that wouldn't be particularly suspicious if he wasn't highlit, but considering he was, that might throw a little bit of extra suspicion on him. There's nothing left for him in this conversation unless he wants to try for a bug here. 
And he doesn't, but he fails on pathing. And let's get an instant replay on that. Well, actually, no, he's actually a little bit head on this stream. So I'm going to pause that for a moment and play it. And hopefully that will have the stream synced back up again. Minute and 16 to go and two missions to do. Won't be easy, but it can certainly be done. Blood Wolf actually has a hell of a lot of lowlights here. Only four possibilities left. Only two highlights. And one of those is drawn. Goes to the statue here. Once again, pause this for a moment and play it. Fix this up. He wants to swap. He really does. But Blood Wolf's looking at it far too closely for him to get away with it. He might go for the green. He does. I don't think Blood Wolf actually even had time to see the swap happen before he shot. I think it was just enough that what was happening what was happening to... I don't know where I'm going with this, so I'm just going to stop and drink water. Either way, Blood Wolf pulling ahead by one in the 11th game. And this is actually a really close match so far, which is fun. Um, thank you. Dupless for picking this one over the other game because the other game probably would have been over by now. Going into game number 12, Blood Wolf as streams a little bit ahead, so pausing that. Are we good? No, we're not. Pausing you for a moment. And I'm just going to leave it now. I'm assuming everything is okay. Blood Wolf actually in a fairly good position for his banana bread here, but he's holding off for some reason. I just, honestly, this position... Oh my god! The double agent left! Sad face! There's a weird twitch to get rid of Toby instead of just declining his drink. Here he goes. Looks like he's gonna go for the, uh, the... What are you... What? I did the pathing! Dead <laughs> briefcase. <laughs> Trying to save it. You can do it, Blood Wolf. I believe in you. That pathing was terrifying. Goes for the bug off the briefcase, actually. Does he get away with that? Uh, he missed the pad, so no, he doesn't. Whenever you miss a pad, when you're at this high-level play, you're probably going to get shot. That's just unfortunate. That really was. Tied at six. After 12 games. Because math. I don't know why I keep saying that. You guys can... If I say tied at six, you know it's 12. But... I need to talk about something while... Um... I'll wait for the next game to start. And generally my technique here is to just talk. Because as soon as I stop talking, the show is not occurring anymore. What do I mean by that? As soon as I stop talking, this is not interesting any longer. I lose people's focus is what happens. Um, they're actually taking quite a bit of a break here between games. Probably just discussing what's happening. Here we go. Looks like we're about to get things underway here. Drawn onward, playing Spy this time around. Tied at six. Here we go. Is he going to time add? Yes, he is going to time add. Doesn't get a green test, but that's all right. I don't think Blood Wolf caught him on that. No, he didn't. Gets a quick flirt in, but uh, really not a very high quality one, considering she's on the other end of the... Um, 
of the conversation. He's probably going to need to get a green test at some point to make up for that. Here goes the banana bread. Another white test. Oh my god! The AI drawn onward is having actually probably more AI troubles than Blood Wolf is this match. Which is shocking to me. But, Double H decides to be nice and give Drawn Onward another chance. Here's a second banana bread going off. There it is. Stops talking immediately. And actually get snaps McGee shot for it. So that is actually quite a surprising turn of events for me. Drawn onward, taking the lead for what may actually be the first time tonight? Am I wrong? Was he in the lead at the beginning? Because I think this was the first time this match he's actually taking the lead game-wise. So, ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a match. Here we go. Blood Wolf as Spy. Drawn Onward as Sniper. 6-7 to seven is the scoreline with Drawn Onward in the lead. Blood Wolf stepping up for his first flirt here. And good, he's fairly close, so. That's actually a good point, Morning Track. I don't think there are actually any ladies in the track, in the chat, but there may be ladies watching because not everybody who's watching right now is actually signed in. So, that's a thing. Somebody got shot, by the way, so it's all tied up again. Just thought I'd throw that out there. Am I always this bad when somebody gets shot who's not the spy? Because that was just abysmal. That's not how drama works at all. Wow. <laughs> okay, Virifo. Looks like we're going to balcony this time around. Isn't... Okay, now the chat's talking. Uh, Gunom, yes, is female. Isn't Noche also female? For some reason, I have it in my head that no, she's female. I'm not sure why. I don't know if that's true or not. Anyways, there's a game happening on Balcony. So, this map's tiny, and it's fun, and it's interesting. And a flirt has occurred, but I don't think that actually got him to 50%, so I'm going to cringe again if it gets another green test. If not, I'll be fine. And I think Balcony really plays more into the sniper view than... There's actually another banana bread with the... I lost my train of thought because briefcases was occurring and my brain exploded. Anyways, am I right in saying that... We have a low light? Yes, Drawn Onward's low lit. That's why I got confused as soon as I entered Sniper Mode, because Drawn Onward's low lit. Blood Wolf only has two suspects right now, and neither of them are Drawn Onward. Drawn Onward can get away with murder here. He can probably just bug right in front of people, and no one will notice. Of course, he doesn't know he's low lit, so he's not going to try it. He's actually, Drawn Onward's really low on time here. I don't know if he's going to pull this off. Well, briefcase, this is some of that AI weirdness I was talking about. Purple Dress decides to pick up the briefcase right next to the Ambassador. Which is awesome. Wasn't really her fault, because she, like, arrived at the briefcase before the Ambassador arrived right the F next to the briefcase. And it still looked weird enough for her to get shot by it. And I believe this is where... The crazy AI shenanigan really kicks in the full swing. Blood Wolf going spy mode this time. For a moment there, I thought he was going to add time, and I got freaked out. Anyways, 
not in a very good position at all for the flirt. Banana bread might come off though now. Too many people outside of conversation now. He had a chance for a moment. Wasn't able to capitalize on it. Blue Danger is the man to watch in case you don't remember. Actually has a pretty nice opportunity for a flirt here. Doesn't get the green test though. So he's going to have to do at least two more of those. He's managed to avoid a highlight so far, which is nice. So that may all change when the banana bread comes off. This could be it. Yep, yeah, there it is. It was a white test. Though it doesn't look like he's going to get highlight for it. Drawn onward, just sticking with his two suspects. Sticking with his gut. And Blood Wolf. A minute and a mission to do. He still needs two flirts, so that could be a bit of an issue. I'm not really sure how he's going to do this without being too suspicious. He's probably going to wait for the fl for this section target to leave combo and follow him. That seems like the only way he'll be able to get it done. Did he just fake banana bread? Or was the other one not real? Am I missing something here? Is he trying to get somebody shot? Because I don't think it's working. This is going to be hard. He's not high lit, but he doesn't have time to get this done. Drawn onward, takes the bait, and takes the shot. I am really proud of that line. I need to use that more often. That was a good line. That made me really happy. We're tied at eight, by the way. So once again, we're tied up. But takes the bait and takes the shot. I... That made me proud, and I don't think that's a good thing. Hmm. <laughs> Anyways, more balcony. Um, drawn on with a spy. Purple dress. Uh, nothing happening super quick. So, looks like he might actually... I know what I was about to say there. I just kind of started talking for a moment. Let's take a look at the sniper view here. A few highlights going off. There's a banana bread. Uh, not bad. Only orange just was outside combo at the time. Uh, goes for the flirt here. Gets the green test on it. So one more nice flirt will finish that up. And he's... Blood Wolf, I mean, is... Shooting the wrong person at this point in time, giving drawn word. Drawn word? Okay, from now on I'm calling him drawn word, because that's hilarious. Um, drawn onward goes up 9 to 8. Drawn word. Silly. Anyways, drawn onward. Um, I'm not really sure what happened as far as Brimsworth goes to get himself shot, but there's so many little things that happen in Balcony. Shots can come out when nobody expects them, except, I guess, the sniper. But, um... That's one of the things that makes Balcony so fun. It's a really fast-paced map, it's really small. And everything is visible 100% of the time, unless you're awesome. Um, I have to keep talking because they're not going into the next game here. I've dropped... I have not yet dropped over 9,000 frames, but I'm close. Wait for it. Here we go. Yes! Over 9,000 frames dropped! That is not a good thing, but I'm still happy about it. Anyways, more games on Ver... Nope, never mind. I thought it was Veranda. It's actually just Balcony again. Light Blue Jacket is the man to watch. And it looks like a fairly ineffectual flirt will be going right off the bat. There it goes. What are you doing, Ron? <laughs> Stop tapping the shift key. You're confusing me. What are you doing? Anyways, um... Highlight the ambassador, just to make sure... Jesus, that 
freaks me out whenever you do that. I keep thinking you're going to shoot somebody. Um, there's the banana bread goes off. I don't think he's man. He's had a chance to get another flirt in here. No, he hasn't. But he hasn't been highlit either. He's got a minute and ten seconds and at least two flirts to go. If they're positioned well and one's a green test, he should be able to get it done. The pathing on green dress, light green dress there was not, was odd, but probably low light odd, if you ask me. Here comes out red flannel, looks like he's going to go to the window. Oh, actually, Blood Wolf timed that brilliantly. I didn't see the pathing because it looks like he's getting laser burned. No, it was just coincidental. That was a fantastic flirt, so we should... Going into the conversation here, be able to get this done. I'm actually going to go into the Blood Wolf view to see... Okay, he really needs the green test here. If he doesn't get the green test, he's probably going to lose. Here we go. It all comes down to this. Here comes the flirt. Misses the green test! And then gets shot. So, doesn't matter. That was almost super dramatic. Um, and then he just took a bullet, so drawn onward up 10 to 8 right now, with 3 minutes left, so we're probably going to leave it at one more no, I don't want to say that um you know what, I'll give it 2 more games to give Blood Wolf a chance to epic comeback and tie it up um after that, I'm going to cut it off because long stream is long. And we're only about halfway through. Maybe I'll do the second half next week. But, Balcony continues to occur. Burgundy Dress is a spy as this game starts off with like practically nobody in the conversation. That seduction target is not being particularly helpful here. There it goes off the banana bread. Seduction target was actually the only person outside of combo there, so it wasn't bad. It wasn't great though. Am I? Yeah, the timing's a little bit off on this, so pause and play. Yeah, that's right. Seduction Target actually hasn't been in the conversation this entire game. 50 seconds gone, and not a single chance to flirt. What are you doing, Seduction Target? Be a pal, man. Come on. Drawn Onward's going to have some serious problems. He won't get in the frickin' combo. A minute to go, and he finally, finally comes to chat. Frickin' antisocial Seduction Target. Doesn't even get the green test on that. I'm being totally distracted by the chat, so I'm going to stop looking at that for the time being till this game ends. And Drawn Onward actually gets the bug, and I totally missed it, and he got his missions done. Four seconds to go, and I don't think he's going to take the bullet here. Generalissimo gets shot. Drawn Onward goes ahead 11 to 8. And with one more game lined up, wow, actually, I actually randomly accidentally decided to stop it at an even 20. So, that's a thing. It's 11 to 8 right now, one more game to be played. And I think I made that suitably dramatic, in a sense, but... I generally have issues when the wrong person gets shot. I think I did a decent job there. But as we're going to the last game here, once again on Balcony, Blood Wolf as Spy, not Virifo as Sniper. Actually, a beautiful position for a fast flirt. Gets it off. That was nice. Goes to take his drink, and I can only assume he's going to go in for the banana bread here. Never mind, people are leaving combo. takes a quick sidestep, and I can only assume he didn't time at there. Please tell me he didn't time at there. Okay, good. Here he comes in for the flirt. Not sure what the highlight was for. Probably for walking by the ambassador as he did. 
is in a good position to get the flirt off here. We're going to actually have a look at to see how he does this action test wise. Here comes the flirt. Actually, signals instead. I'm a little bit surprised about that, but there's the double agent. It was a white test, so that's a problem. He's already high lit, and white testing, that's not going to help. People are leaving the conversation. So... Duty bugged somebody, and I totally missed it. That's awesome. I totally didn't see that at all. That's... That's pretty nice. Anyways, um, that'll be all for today. Final scoreline is 9-11 to in Drawn Onward's favor. Damn good series of matches, though. Also, the AI was amazing, so that certainly helped. Um, I might do more of this next week. Probably won't, though. Um, if I get better streams going up next time around, I'll do those instead. It's continuing to drop frames. We're evening out at 9,788 frames dropped at approximately 14% of frames dropped, I mean. So... I suppose that's it. I'll see you on Tuesday at same time, same place. For those who have, for those who aren't sure. Um, but until then, I guess I'm done for now. So without further ado, this is Deboshi signing off.